Hey guys, what's going on? It's Nark. Welcome along to a brand new video. We are into Chapter 3, The Return, here on Portal 2. Which is probably signifying the return of GLaDOS to the um, chamber and everything. Oh, hey, Wheelie. What's going on? Well, I'm back. The aerial faith plate in here is sending a distress signal. You broke it, didn't you? I, I there, just stepped on it. Now. That's all I did. That's all I did. Mm, this plate must not be calibrated to someone of your generous. <laughs> there we go. The How did I miss all of like these weight insults? Very healthy. <laughs> Very healthy. <laughs> I'm glad I was. Uh, okay. You seem to have defeated its load bearing capacity. Well done. I'll just lower the ceiling. I'm sure I heard like a laser a moment ago. Which is weird. I don't know where that's coming from. Alright, so we've got a laser here. Alright, so... I guess first things first, we're going to go over to... Here! Oh, wow, that wall's there. The wall seems a bit... Like, it's in the way, but I don't really know why it's there. I could have just jumped through there as well. That would have saved a lot of time. I guess, suppose... Alright, now we take the cube. I haven't actually seen where the receptacle is, but I'm guessing it's going to be where that ant line is. And I guess... Uh, we just need to do this, right? This would make the most sense. Yeah, okay. Look at you, sailing through, sailing the, through the air, the air majestically, majestically, like, an, like eagle. an eagle, piling out a blimp. blimp. I know too many of these voice lines. Too many community test chambers played. You're not here when I'm on my maps. I tend to keep out music and voice lines where possible. Anywho, moving swiftly on. Enjoy this next test. I'm going to go to the surface. It's a beautiful day out. Yesterday I saw a deer. If you solve this next test, maybe I'll let you. Yesterday she saw a deer. Yesterday he was dead, Gladys. Do you mean yesterday as in yesterday, or yesterday as in the, like, the last day he was alive? Because you weren't alive yesterday, Gladys. Unless, of course, the day has changed, and I'm unaware of it because I'm so far underneath. Which could be a possibility. But yeah, that doesn't make to sense room. to me. Anyway, that's enough. Uh, so we need to go and get the cube. Oh, yeah, well, we, we could just do this. Let's try that again, shall we? Oh, my goodness. I suck. Finally, Nox failing. I love the dynamicness of the maps. I feel like I like made a real meal of this, but hey, we got the cube. Fantastic. And of course that stops moving. Uh, okay, so can I now do... I think I can. Let's go over here. And get through here. I, oh my goodness. Wow. Uh, what? What the hell happened to the cube there? I do not know. That was just strange and bizarre. Um, I'm pretty sure this one... There was an achievement for this one. We had to, like, complete it in a certain amount of time, I'm pretty sure. Am I imagining that, or... I'm just going to hit the faith plate. And... I guess we're going to want to aim this... Over in this direction. I guess that would make sense. Also, the soundtrack. I never really noticed like the songs in the soundtrack before as well. But, um... Yeah. 
I'm actually hearing them now. Which is really weird. I don't know. I obviously I just I'm quite um not naive. Naive's not the right word. I'm quite ignorant well, to like voice lines test. and like soundtracks and things in, in video games, today. clearly. I did see some humans. But with you here, I've got more test subjects than I'll ever need. But yeah. I could test so much together to like the community chambers and everything. It's quite weird. Yeah. Quite weird, yeah. Why I said that in a German accent, I do not know. Moving on. These bridges are made from natural Ooh, light, light that I pump off. in from the surface. If you rubbed your cheek on one, it would be like standing outside with the sun shining on your face. It would also set your hair on fire, so don't actually do it. Right, so if I remember this puzzle... Which I think I had a load of trouble with the first time I played this, if I remember rightly. I think I may have died multiple times. Um... Really? It's so simple. I think I just like kept falling off the light bridge and stuff, and the last light bridge like clips through the wall. And like that. Sweet. Excellent. Thank you. Are you. And hey, these there's tests the are your prey. turret queen. Speaking of which, I was researching sharks for an upcoming test. Sharks? Do you really? know who else murders people who are only trying to help them? Did you guess sharks? Because that's wrong. The correct answer is nobody. Nobody but you is that pointlessly cruel. <laughs> I'm so pointlessly cruel. Apparently. Good news. I figured out what to do with all the money I save recycling your one room full of air. When you die, I'm going to laminate your skeleton and pose you in the lobby. That way, future generations can learn from you how not to have your unfortunate bone structure. Perfect. The door's <laughs> not functioning. I guess somebody's going to have to repair that, too. No, don't get up. I'll be right back. Don't touch anything. Just give me a port surface glass now. Oh, hello. I found some bird eggs up here. Just dropped them into the door mechanism. Shut it right down. I, ah! Bird! 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 <laughs> okay. Just give me a pull. That's probably the bird in it that laid the eggs. Livid. Okay, look, the point is, we're going to break I love the West Country here, accent. Right? Soon, I, I really wish I had a West Country accent. I just have to figure out how to break us out of here. Here she comes. Keep te Just keep testing. Remember, you never saw me. Never saw me. I went and spoke with the door mainframe. Let's just say he won't be, well, living anymore. Anyway, back to testing. Was the door frame ma mainframe ever living, Gladys? Uh, where am I going with this? Over here, I guess. Again, another test where I think I'm pretty sure I like made a completely not a hash of the first time I played it. In fact, it. you did so well. I'm going to note this on your file in the commendation section. Oh, there's lots of room here. Did well enough. I did well enough. That's good enough for me. That is good enough for me. This next test involves turrets. You remember Ooh, them, right? Not turrets. They're the pale spherical things that are full of bullets. Oh wait, that's you in five seconds. Good luck. So this, I kind of remember. This, this is like a modernized version of the the turret room from the original Portal, right? Yeah, I'm sure that's like the that's what that is. Ooh, we have to go BTS. 
Interesting. Yeah, that's um, it's it's very similar to the turret room uh, of Portal One, and as much as I don't think this is as um, there's not not as much tutorially as Portal One, but there is still like that aspect of it. So um, I find that really good that like they kept they kept that sort of like originality part of it. Yesterday was your birthday. I thought you'd want to know. Thanks. It was my birthday. It was my birthday. Uh, I guess this is the test to teach you about bread, relays then. But you're going to be dead in 60 years. Well, I've been working on a belated birthday present for you. Oh, well, thanks. more of a belated birthday medical procedure. Well, technically, it's a medical experiment. What's important is it's a present. A present from GLaDOS. It's never going to be good, is it? Let's face it. No present from her is ever good. That jumpsuit you're wearing looks stupid. That's not me talking. It's right here in your file. On other people, it looks fine. But right here, a scientist has noted that on you, it looks stupid. Well, what does a neckbearded old engineer know about fashion? He probably... Oh, wait. It's a she. Still... What does she know? Oh wait, it says she has a medical degree. In fashion. From France. I'm going through the list of test subjects in cryogenic storage. I managed to find two with your last name. A man and a woman. I seem to remember getting absolutely so rinsed at that the original time. It's a small world. I think it took me a long while to um, work out that I could block myself with the light bridge. And I think I got like wrecked over and over again by those turrets surrounding the cube. How, how funny it is, I find, that you can, like, go back and just, like, just rip yourself apart of how you struggle with things. All right, this... Take that. Rector Rock's triggered. I totally missed. What the hell? Sweet! Obviously over there, um, if I remember rightly, is the like turret orchestra practicing. For like the like the ending part, the ending elevator sequence. But um yeah. I don't know why Klaus is like humming, he's a jolly good fellow. It's quite worrying. Especially when I'm a she. It says I hear this lasers. test was designed by one of Aperture's Nobel Prize winners. It doesn't say what the prize was for. Well, I know it wasn't for being immune to neurotoxin. Alright, I got this. Easy peasy. Maybe. I'll do. I should do. I have always wondered when L when LB kind of um I didn't. In fact, we're headed when LB says, you know, about a, 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 like single-player campaign years, difficulty, I I know I've said this like in previous videos, but yeah, I didn't realize that the, the actual campaign was this easy. It's crazy. Claire declares it. So, the guys, that brings us to the end of Chapter 3, The Return. When we come back, we will continue with Chapter 4, The Surprise. Hope you're enjoying the playthrough so far. Um, if you are, please like, comment, subscribe down below. I look forward to any comments or discussions you want to strike up with me about the game, uh, especially with my thoughts running through this, like, a third time. But until next time, I've been Nock, you've been awesome. Happy gaming.